house. Period. Say it with the respect and the reverence that it deserves. Pounce! Well, it pounce. Much better. The most devastating move in professional wrestling. The pounce. The end. Finesse. No more. Pounce. You're a race car driver, I'm sure. Crashing into the wall at 200 miles an hour. That is what the pounce feels like. Look out! There it is! Caught him with the power of the pounce! It's just devastating right there! Here it goes! Oh, he couldn't recover! The winner of the match, the alpha male, Mommy Brown! Many of you saw that. I'll tell you what, if I, I, I don't know if you can see it right here. It's Monty Brown trying to throw. So he's second, and here it is! The pounce! There it is! There is the pounce! He talks about it being fourth and one in the goal line, and he's just separated mind from body. Of the alpha incredible male. Incredible strength. Taking Lovett overhead, dropping him down to the mat, and now quickly follows up the attack. Shot oh, here it goes. Are you kidding me? He caught him with it. There's the pounce. He just leveled it with the pounce. That's what I'm talking about. You know what he says? Separating mind from body. That's exactly what the alpha male oh. did, and the pounce leads to another win. The winner of the match, the alpha male, Monty Brown. Let us jerk. King of the Mountain, there are no mountains in the Serengeti. I've got my eye on you, and I can't wait to give you the power. Oh, oh, period. Powering. I mean, he's unorthodox as a wrestler, but he makes up for it in brute strength and his athleticism. The shoot banks off into the road. Oh, there it is. There's the pounce. Out of nowhere, you see the alpha male connect with the pounce, take down Antonio Banks. Gonna go for the pin, gonna go for the cover. Puts him away to remain unbeaten. The winner of the match, the alpha male, Monty Brown. And wait a minute. Sam <laughs> Hardy over here with the pounce by Monty Brown. The alpha male, Monty Brown, out of nowhere, connecting with the pounce on Jeff Hardy. We'll see you next week on Impact, but don't miss Hardy. Wednesday night, Jeff Hardy, you will find out that the alpha male is the number one contender, and you will get pounced, period. Oh, man, he is fired up. I mean, Mike, the strength of Monty Brown is truly, truly scary when you think about it. Right back to the offense. Oh, no. it off Here we go. All the way to the other side of the ring. That was devastating. Knocked him to the other side of the six-sided ring with the pounce. Oh, Boots Steel is done. I don't even know if he's even conscious right there. Look at this. I can probably pin him right now. And there's the three count and yes, another win for Monty Brown. Brown, Jeff Hardy, but AJ Styles didn't see it coming and Monty Brown turned him inside out. And you called for the pound. Oh, there it is. And Jimmy Rave just leveled. Jimmy Rave on the receiving end of that devastating oh, pound oh, oh, from the alpha male Monty Brown. Going to drag him back out towards the middle of the ring. And gets the three count. It's academic. Oh, the winner of the match, the alpha male, Monty Brown. That's, it almost even sounds a little bit to me like maybe the king of the mountain doesn't want Monty Brown to get to the major leagues into a title match anytime soon because he knows if he hits the count, count, and he just cleaned it with the pound. I was going to talk about Demetrius Anglin being the opponent here for Monty Brown, but in essence, he turns out to be the latest victim of the pounds. Cover two. Tell that he's just sensing victory here. It's almost just a matter of time. Adam Flash. Oh, here he goes. Here it is. Pounds it, my gosh. He pounced him all the way across the ring. As the alpha male Monty Brown says, he just hit the pounce, period. And there's the three count. It is academic. It is, period. Exclamation point. There's your winner, the alpha male Monty Brown. As you can see, I will be dying to give you the power. Period. 
Let's all have best of programming highlighting the absolute cream of the crop. The best matches for total nonstop action. Look out! There's that pounce! Oh man, was it devastating! When he hits it, it's all she wrote! And you know what? He's warming up in his mind. You know what's next? But I'll tell you what's next for, for Bordell Walker. It's a three count. Yet another victory for the alpha male Monty Brown. Brown fights it off. Only barely four minutes left in this match, and then Larry Zabisco is going to have to make one tough decision. In the event that this match exceeds our TV time allotted, we'll have the results. Oh, of the Almost as if he's a man on a mission as of late, being deprived of that shot at Jeff Jarrett in the NWA title. Look out! Bounce! Oh, what a bounce! That devastating wow. finishing move from the alpha male as he connects with the pounce on Eric Stevens. Going to drag him to the middle of the ring. Going to go for the cover and... Didn't even have to play him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Only a two count. I, thought, I no. took it for, for granted. I mean, look at Stevens. He can't even move. You can see our senior official, Rudy Charles, just by his body language, how surprised he is as well. Stevens can barely get to his feet here. What's Buddy Brown doing? The guy can't even walk. It's over. you got to be kidding me. Another bounce. That's what we just talked about. What is he doing? He's more aggressive than ever. That's called sending a message. No more bounces if I kill him. I've never seen that before. I have never seen him do two in a row. Two pounces from the alpha male Monty Brown. As the strong is so ready. Raven thought that he was going to be able to come out with the lights down, attack Monty Brown, put him in the straight jacket. Oh, another pounce by Monty Brown as he just pounced on everybody tonight. Just another example. Wait when the lights are together, it's all coming to culmination November 7th, and like we mentioned. Anybody that has a television test is going to be able to get this on November 7th. And wow, there's a pounce. Right there by Monty Brown. Takes down Mark Stevens. Now turns his attention to his handicapped tag team partner, Eric Stevens. And the alpha male goes right back to the offensive. Here he goes. Oh, just absolutely caught him. Two pounces in a matter of two seconds. Unbelievable. Two pounces for the price of one from the alpha male. Now Monty Brown has got Stevens and Stevens, and he's going to put them together and pin them both at the same time. Unbelievable! Slam him in victory and, row. And not no. just stupid and slam him, he held him in the, in the air for an extended period of time. Is he gonna go for the pound? Oh, oh Coleman! And the referee's down too, and it cracks the ball. Senior official Rudy Charles down after the impact of the pound. Mighty Brown says, if you want to join the ring, take that. Yeah, there's another one of the Kings right there. Here it is! The pound! He has got it. If you're ever going to get a vulnerable Monty Brown, this is going to be it. Oh, wait a minute. And ah! he lost the vulnerable. He missed his the pass. He decided to make short work of it, I guess. One, two, wow. The alpha male body. There can only be one alpha male. And you are looking at him. and the reverence that it deserves. Ah! What has the alpha male done? He has destroyed and dismantled everyone he put in his path. Sabu, caribou to the alpha male. Black Kenny, destroyed. Sonny Siaki, dominated. Dino Brown, out! That head right off his shoulders. By 
five years in the National Football League as a member of the New England Patriots and the Buffalo Bills. Wow! Jared, you are one. Away from me taking it. Say it with the respect and the reverence that it deserves. Well, it counts. Much better. The most devastating move in professional wrestling is the pounce. The end. Beneath. No more. The pounce. Yeah!